A person breaks into an ambulance in San Francisco. That and more news coming up on SyncedIn. Hey everyone, car break-ins in San Francisco seem to be the norm lately, but this one is unusual. Authorities say an attacker smashed the windows of an ambulance with a wooden tree stake while two paramedics were inside. They got out after the attack and then the suspect reportedly jumped into the ambulance and tried to run them over. This happened on Harrison Street in the city's Mission District around 7 a.m. on Monday. The paramedics were thankfully not injured in the attack, but are, quote, rightfully shaken up, according to the firefighters' union. SFPD is investigating the attack. No arrests have been made so far. In other local news, it was a messy Monday morning out in Vacaville after a big rig carrying a load of tomatoes crashed on Interstate 80. Happened around 5 a.m. CHP says a truck collided with another vehicle, lost control, and went through the center divide, dumping all those tomatoes across the eastbound lanes. Four cars trying to drive through after the spill reportedly also crashed into each other. Officials say three people were sent to the hospital. No word on their condition. Crews were sent in to clean up. All lanes were cleared around 3 p.m. Well, in weather news, don't let this cool start to the week fool you. There's heat coming our way. Here's meteorologist Carrie Hall with your weekly forecast, including a look at your Labor Day weekend. Well, happy Monday to you, and hopefully you're enjoying the cooler temperatures we're starting out with this week. We better take it in because there are some hotter temperatures coming our way by the Labor Day holiday weekend. Take a look at our inland forecast with highs reaching into the mid 80s for some of our warmest spots inland and then trending more toward the upper 90s by the end of the weekend. And for San Francisco here, we're starting out the week with some upper 60s. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds and some issues with some air quality, a little bit more smoke coming again, but then as we head toward the end of the week into the weekend, looks like that fog remains close enough by to where we only see our highs reaching into the upper 70s. We'll be watching that very closely because we do have some big heat expected for our interior valleys. We'll be tracking all of that. You can always get the latest forecast right here on social media as well as NBCBayArea.com. Thanks, Carrie. You can follow Carrie across social media to see her daily forecasts. All right, guys, that's all I've got for you today. Thanks for watching.